Welcome to the Rusted Garden. These are my fall greens. I'm going to so show you another section up on my deck. But I planted these about three weeks ago into the containers and into the raised beds. But I started them in these seed cells towards the end of August, I think. And for me, I usually start running out of energy around the end of August, beginning of September. So I just make sure I get my greens, my fall crops actually, into the seed cells because they can stay in there for a while. The weather's cooler, they do okay. And then as soon as I get open space, like I just cleared out the tomatoes from these containers, I can drop them in. So it's really a great way to get your fall crops started. It's a lot easier to sit down for an hour, plant a whole flat, than it is to come out here and prepare everything. So, you know, if you're like me and you start running out of energy, just get your greens into these seed cells. And then when you have time, you can bring them outside. But they're doing really well. I do a mix of different kinds of romaine lettuces, endives, mustard greens, and you can see that they're producing nicely. And they're just gonna, you know, continue to get bigger here with the cooler weather, lots of rain come October, November in our area. And greens are so much sweeter when they grow in the cool weather versus in spring, yeah, they taste great, but as soon as June comes and the heat comes, they tend to get bitter. So here are my container so greens up on my deck. These are the same lettuces and greens that came out of the seed cells that I just showed you. I got these into the containers, uh, at least a week, maybe two weeks before the plants I just showed you a couple minutes ago. And they're much bigger and they're doing well. You don't have to space your greens out as they say on the seed pack. You can put them, you know, that close together. They're going to grow nicely. They're going to have great leaves and you can just cut the leaves off and let this keep going until the heavy freezes come and kill them off. This is a great way to get greens for two seasons. Let me show you the ones over here too going through my tomatoes that I'm saving for seeds. Here are more greens. And like I said, you can get two seasons of cool weather crops here in Maryland Zone 7. You know, just use your containers. These all had tomatoes in them. These had carrots. These are actually carrots. You know, this is a great mustard green. I want to stress our one. You have two seasons of cool weather crops in Maryland, the spring and the fall. And if your garden's full, you're running out of energy, just try and start your lettuces, your greens in seed cells towards the end of August. And when you get the energy or the space in your garden, you can take them right out of the seed cells, put them into the containers that might've had tomatoes, peppers, or whatever, you know, and in a couple of weeks, you'll have lettuces and greens. Those are carrots that look like this and you'll extend your growing season. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please check out my blog at www.therustedgarden.blogspot.com and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.